Okay, I'm going to show how to install the cloud robot. Okay, so we're going to go right here to uh, brokers. First thing you got to do is have a MetaTrader account. So um, you could download a demo or a real account. Okay, you have to have the MetaTrader platform from any of the brokers. It could be FXCM or you have a real or demo from Forex.com or FXDD. Okay, so to, you go to our website, myfxti.com. And you go to the brokers uh, section. Now, once you have it installed, okay, uh, once you purchase the robot, you're going to have a file. Okay, it's called Cloud Robot. And you're going to go to the indicators, and we're going to copy the three indicators. We're going to right click, copy. Okay, now you're going to go to your MetaTrader. Let's say this is the MetaTrader. We're going to right click and go to the property section. Now we're going to say open the file location. Okay, and you're going to go to experts. Okay, and you're going to go under the indicator section and you're going to paste these right here. So you right click and paste. Okay, so I paste uh, these indicators. Now you go back uh, to the file. Now the ones that are outside the file, these are our expert advisors. So we're just going to select these. We're going to right click and we're going to copy these also then we're going to go to the MetaTrader right click properties okay and we're going to open the uh, file location right here okay so I'm going to click right here open file location and we're going to go to experts okay and we're just going to paste them right here outside the experts uh, tool so I'm going to right click here and paste okay and you can see how outside the folder and uh, I should have these three uh, pasted. Now, once I do that, I have to close out my uh, MetaTrader platform, and then I'm going to reopen the MetaTrader platform. Okay. Now, what's going to happen is I'm going to open up any chart. So, for example, let me load here the Euro chart. Okay. Now, once I go to the navigator section. If you don't have the navigator section, you can view it by going view, uh, navigator, and you're going to go to the expert advisor, and we're going to load the Kumo breakout. Okay, and I'm going to double click here, and what's going to do is going to open up uh, the indicator. And you can see how uh, you want to have this checked where it says allow live trading. That means it's automatically going to put trades on your account. And you want to have the allow DLO imports and the allow uh, imports on external exports here. Now you're going to go inputs. And on the input tab is where you can customize this trade. You can say what type of lot you want it to trade. So, for example, if you put 0 0.1, that's going to be trading a mini lot. If you put, for example, 1.0, that'll be trading a standard lot. Okay, let's say we want to trade it a mini lot. Okay, and then uh, the only other parameter you want to change is you can automatically put what stop loss. So whenever whenever it sells or goes short, how many pips uh, stop loss? Now this is a key feature. For example, on this broker, you can see how it's 131.6. Sorry, let me erase this. On this broker, for example, the quote is 131.637. So this is a broker that uses a five-digit uh, uh, five digit quote. Okay, so for example, if I wanted a 75 pip stop, it would be 570 because we're using three quotes right here. Uh, if I want a 50 pip stop, you guys could put any stop uh, that you want. Say I wanted a 50 pip stop, then I'll put 500. That's if you're trading with a five uh, broker. Now, if your broker or the platform that you're trading with has only four digits, then you're only going to play, say, 75, and that would be a 75. But if it has a fifth decimal, you got to add the last uh, zero here. So, say I wanted to put a 50 pip stop uh, every time it enters the trade, I put 50 right here. And then I could put the profit target. Uh, say I want a 100 pip profit target or a 70 pip profit target. I could say 
automatically put a profit of X amount, uh, say 70 pips here. Uh, I can also trail. Trail means that every time it moves the stop, it trails it uh, up. I already use this feature, but I activated it in the software. If you guys want to uh, have it. And then once you put what stop, what profit, all you got to do is put OK. And you want to make sure that this tab right here is open where it says expert advisors and it automatically going to have a happy face on the expert uh, advisors here. Now what does this system do? Uh, if you're on a one hour chart you just want to leave your computer on okay and what it's going to do is every time it breaks the cloud it's going to place a buy for you. Okay so instead of you having to sit around and and wait for the cloud to break it automatically does it for you so it's a key feature and then you can automatically say when it breaks the cloud what stop or what take profit I want to have on it okay so it's a good tool you can leave it on especially in the currency market that's open 24 hours a day and it's gonna work on any time frame that you're on so if you're on the one hour it's gonna anytime it breaks the cloud on a one hour it'll buy if you're on a four hour every time it breaks on a four hour it'll buy. If you're on a daily, every time it breaks on a daily. The only thing you have to make sure is uh, what, so this one's going to be running on the euro, okay, and if you want to run it in additional pairs, you do the same exact thing, and it's going to buy every time it breaks the cloud to the upside or it breaks the down cloud to the downside, and you could customize your take profit and uh, stop loss. It's a real nice feature. Um, you can even use it, say you're going to go to sleep and you want it to automatically, just in case it breaks the cloud while you're sleeping, to put a buy or put a sell. Uh, this system will automatically do it. So I'm going to go over one more time. Let me load it. For example, say I want to load it on the pound on a four hour chart or on a one hour chart. Say I'm waiting to see if this breaks to the downside and I want to automatically get in. I just go to my navigator. After installed, I go to the Kumo breakout. Okay, in common, uh, I want to allow live trading, allow DLL, allow uh, imports and external. And then here I place the lot size that I want. Uh, I put my stop, whatever stop size, every time it goes short. Okay, and every time it goes uh, long. Yeah. So I'm trading here. This one also has five decimals. So say I wanted a 75 pip stop loss, I can place seven and that, that'll depend on the time frame that you're trading and then a, a profit target say I want a profit target of a hundred pips every time it breaks uh, I would put a thousand but it's really a hundred pips since the last decimal place and I place OK and if it has a happy face here and this is on and my PC is on it's gonna buy every time that you enter uh, a trade here so it's a real nice feature it automatically places trades for you uh, with your stop and your limit and obviously using the cloud which is a very effective method uh, you can see here if it would have bought here you would have made profit if it would have sold here you would have made profit and we just finished creating it's a very easy feature to use and it's nice since you don't have to be uh, around it and you'll see the trades that it places uh, once you have it on the cloud break you can see this dollar cat trade um, was placed. I'll go to the dollar CAD. Okay. And um, it was placed on the break of that cloud automatically. Uh, you can see the dollar Swiss. If I go to the dollar Swiss chart, okay, uh, it was placed at the break of the cloud. It's up nicely. And the euro was also placed at the break of uh, the cloud. Uh, which is right here on the cloud break uh, and it's up nicely so you can see here it's made over three thousand just on four trades on the cloud break okay so this is how you install it and you put it to work okay any questions contact our office if you want to feel like purchasing and get it going um, the files uh, they run on MetaTrader uh, you can contact our office